Hey everybody, this is Dominate from Seven Sins. Uh, just here to make a quick little video um, on how to extract and replace your game saves uh, via Horizon. So obviously you're going to need the Horizon program. Uh, this will be in the thread that I'll link in the description here on where to download this. <clears throat> uh, you do not need a Diamond membership to modify Borderlands 2 saves. Um, so you don't have to worry about that. Um, once you've copied your save over from your Xbox on your flash drive, you'll plug that in your computer and it'll load up in here in Horizon and it'll be under Games and Borderlands 2. And there's a couple different ways you can extract your save. Uh, from this point right here, you can extract the file and it will save it to your desktop or wherever you'd like to put it. And it'll be named save 0001 or whatever number it is. Um, that's a container file. So basically what that contains is it's not the actual character save file. So uh, if you were to go and try and open this up in Gibbed right now, um, what you're going to find is it's going to give you this message right here. I see people post this all the time saying, why isn't this working? I'm getting this message. And basically what this is saying is you need to extract the save via Horizon, so that's what we're going to do. So if you drag the file over into this gray area, this is the actual container file, so this is what contains your Xbox information as far as profile ID, device, console, blah, blah, blah. Uh, what you actually need is just a character save file, which is this guy right here. So you go to the Contents tab, click on Save Game, right-click, and extract this file extracted wherever you'd like. Now we have this file here. It's always going to be save game dot save for an Xbox file. So now we go into Gibbed. Click on that. Make sure you select Xbox 360 down here. And voila, it opens up. So now you can do whatever modding that you need to do to your save. Add your currencies, uh, whatever you want to your backpack. And then uh, when you go to save it, just save over that same file, wherever it is. And then to fix it, put it back in the save, you go back into here and just right click and hit replace. And you'd find the save that you want, hit OK or open, and it'll give you a message saying you've replaced it. And then don't forget to hit save, rehash, and resign up here. Now if you're loading this directly from your USB. Uh, once you hit save, rehash, and resign, it will automatically um, be saved to your flash drive. If you're downloading a container file or a dummy save that you've dragged into Horizon, it will give you the option to save to USB device, which will then load it over onto your USB. Also note that if I were have um, edited this save say up to level 61 or whatever I wanted the actual description here will not change until you've actually loaded the save up on your system so don't worry about that um, basically that's all you have to do um, you should be able to then take your flash drive back copy it back over to your Xbox um, I typically recommend removing the backup files before copying them back over now that they have an auto backup feature um, just to make sure everything copies over correctly. Um, anyways, if you have any questions or uh, help with this, I would recommend going to the thread that I'll have linked in the description. Um, I don't really check the YouTube all that much, but there's plenty of people um, that could help out over at Seven Sins. Uh, so, everyone, have a good day. Take it easy.